welcome to Campbell Inspirational Time. This year, we have promised to break the icebergs. And as part of breaking the icebergs, our desire is to inspire and encourage our clients and also push them to be their very best. Today, I want to share a story with you. A story about an inspirational message I wrote. And the inspirational message was about dealing with your down moments. After I shared the message, somebody took the message and the person, when I posted the quest, uh, the, the message, the person thought I copied the message from somebody else. We are not knowing that that person rather copied my message concerning down moments. What do I want to say? Sometimes you believe so dearly in doing something. You persist and you are doing it. However, there are so many doubting Thomas, Thomases there who think that you cannot do what you think you can do. However, in those situations, in those moments that people doubt you so much, people don't believe in what you think you can do, what I want to tell you is, even though people doubt you, people don't believe in you, never, never doubt yourself. As far as you assess whatever you desire to do, the dream you have, you assess your capabilities and you start never allow anybody to discourage you from pursuing the dream. The truth is that challenges will by all means come. The truth is that doubt, doubting Thomases will come your way. Never forget, even in the Bible, Jesus Christ was doubted by Thomas. We have the adage, the doubting Thomases, because Thomas, doubt, one of Jesus Christ's own disciples, doubted that Jesus will resurrect. And when the other disciples told Thomas that Jesus resurrected, what did he say? He said, for me, before I believe that Jesus Christ resurrected, I have, I have to see him put my hand into his his side and into the holes in his hand before I believe. That is doubting Thomas. There are doubting Thomases all around us who never think that what you believe in, you can do it. Despite that, I want to tell you, people can doubt, doubt you. Let people doubt you, however, you never doubt yourself because there is something good in you which you can share with people. There is something good in you which you can do and change this world. There is something I always think about and this is it. Do you know why you are created in this dispensation? Do you know why you were not created in Abraham Lincoln's time? Do you know why you were not created in the 1940s or 1930s? As an African, 
who believe so much in Kwame Nkrumah. Do you know why you were not born in Kwame Nkrumah's days? You were born, you are born for this particular time, this dispensation, this season in which you are. Because there is something good in you, you can contribute to this generation. So if you are born in this generation, think about this. Why are you born in this generation? I am an African. The question to ask is, why am I born an African? I'm a Ghanaian. Why am I born a Ghanaian? I'm a black man. Why am I born a black? Is it a curse? I don't think so. Everything man thinketh is in his mind. So when you think that you are an inferior person, it is from your mind. It is not the skin of people that make them great. It is their mindset that makes them great. So never think that because of your color, because of where you come from, because of you are born in this generation, we call this time round, we call it a difficult time. But do you know why you are born in, in this difficult time? All is because there is something in you that you can contribute to this generation. There is something good that you can contribute to your community. There is something good you can con contribute to your country. And also, there is something good you can contribute to your country. So never let yourself down. Never let your creator down. And never let down that great thing that you dream of to do. You are capable. You are capable. And I want to conclude and tell you this. That even though there are challenges that we face, the abilities that we, we have, the prospects, the, the, the potential that you have, is greater than your challenges. So never look at your challenges and give up on yourself. Every day, keep believing in that dream you have. Every day, keep pursuing that dream you have. Every day, when you face challenges, look for solution. Never raise your, your hands up and give up because you are facing challenge. A challenge comes when you face your challenges, you come out with solutions. And it is only solutions that we need to bring out when we find challenges. Another thing I want you to, to note is that sometimes your challenges come to push you up. So if you give up in the time of your challenges, if you give up because somebody doubts you, or if you give up because things are becoming difficult for you, you will never, never achieve your dream. Therefore, my message to you today, even though people will doubt you, never doubt yourself. Take note, know that you are born in your generation, in your community, as whoever you are, you are born at a particular time for a purpose. And that purpose, sometimes it is only you who can help solve that problem. Let me go back again. Kwame Nkrumah attained independence for Ghana with the help of others, I agree. However, can you imagine if he did not believe that Africa can attain independence and be its own and run its own affairs? What do you think will be African situation now? Therefore, always believe there is something good in you. 
and never doubt yourself. Never allow any other person to doubt you because there is something great in you. You can be your best self if you keep believing and you keep pushing. Thank you so much. If you want to follow us, you can follow us on YouTube and our YouTube uh, handle is Campbell Multimedia. If you want to send a message directly to me, you can WhatsApp me on 070-50-579212. And if you are out of Nigeria, you must remember to add the code. And the Nigeria code is plus one plus two three four. And you can also like our pages on social media, on Facebook, on Twitter, on LinkedIn, and on Instagram. Remember, at Campbell, we anchor vision and mission. Thank you so much.